Good morning, boys. Happy Tuesday. Today, for small group, we're going to be doing some art, okay? For our art, we're going to be using Play-Doh. Do you know what we're going to make with our Play-Doh? We're going to make a tree, okay? So, Miss Evie has different color Play-Dohs here. I have blue, I have red, I have yellow, and I have green. But I'm only going to be using my green Play-Doh. And some brown Play-Doh, okay? Miss Evie made the brown Play-Doh herself. Because remember, we're making a tree. And the tree trunk is what color? Brown, right? The tree trunk is brown and the branches are brown. And the leaves are green. Very good. Now, if you have red Play-Doh, you can make red leaves. If you have yellow Play-Doh, you can make yellow leaves because the trees change colors, right? The leaves, I'm sorry. The leaves change color in the spring, in the summer, and the fall. So depending on what tree you want to make, you can use that color Play-Doh, okay? So Miss Evie's going to use brown and green, all right? I'm going to show you how to make a tree with your Play-Doh. Are you guys ready? All right, let's get ready, ready to have fun. So are you ready? All right, Miss Evie has her Play-Doh. I have my brown Play-Doh and my green Play-Doh. And I'm going to take some of my brown Play-Doh and I'm going to make a trunk, okay? The trunk is the big part that holds the tree nice and tall. So I'm going to get some Play-Doh and I'm going to mold it and I'm going to shape it and I'm going to try to make a trunk, okay? So I'm going to try to make it long because I want my tree to be nice and tall. Right, so here I have my play doh, and I'm gonna mold it to how I want my tree trunk to look. Okay, Miss Evie's molding it because I want to make some strong branches. Okay. And then I'm going to get more Play Doh. Right. And I'm going to make branches. I'm going to get more brown Play Doh. And I'm going to roll it so that I can make it skinny. Okay. I'm going to roll it like this. And this is going to be our branches. Okay, see, so he's gonna make branches to her tree. <clears throat> For a branch here, we're gonna put more branches on the other side. Okay, roll a little piece like this. And we're gonna put branches on this side. Okay. You can put as many branches as you want, okay? Miss Evie, I think she's gonna put six branches. All right. This is my last branch. I'm gonna put that branch right there. And then I'm gonna get my green Play-Doh. And I'm going to start making some leaves, okay? So, we're going to try to shape them as best as you can like a leaf, okay? And you're going to stick them on your tree, just like that. Stick them all over your tree and make some leaves. Let's see if he's using what color again? Green to make her leaves, right? I'm using green. Green leaves, brown trunk. Okay. I'm going to put leaves all over. And like I said, if you have red Play-Doh, you can put some red leaves. Because remember, the leaves change color in the, in the fall. They turn from green to brown and red and yellow and orange. So if you have those color Play-Dohs, you can use that, okay? It doesn't necessarily have to be just a green leaf tree. You could put whatever color you want. I'm going to get some, maybe some yellow. Yeah. And put some yellow leaves in there too. Yellow. 
think you could use yellow to make leaves. You could use red or you could use red to make some apples. Yeah. See? Let's see if he has yellow leaves, green leaves. Let's put some more green leaves on this side. Let's move this over a little bit so you can see it. Let's see, he's going to put some leaves over here and some leaves over here and over here. We'll put some yellow ones too. So now I'm using three colors green, yellow, and brown, right? And uh, maybe, maybe I will put some apples in my tree and I'll get some red play and get some red apples. Should I put some red apples? Yeah. Let's see. All right. I'm almost finished with my leaves. I think I'm going to put a couple of apples in my tree. Let's see if I find my red play-doh. Oh, here it is. Found some red play-doh. Now, apples, they're round like balls, right? So we're going to use our fingertips to move the play-doh around and make little balls, right? We're going to make little apples. There you go. One apple, two apples, three apples. Four apples, five, and six. Now, I want you to look very carefully at my tree. Let me see if it has a trunk, right? I have the trunk of the tree. I have branches. I have leaves in green and yellow. And I also put apples on my tree. Okay, so now I want you to go with your mommy and daddy and try to make a Play-Doh tree, okay? And like I said yesterday, like I told mommy and you on, on our Zoom meeting, if you don't have Play-Doh, just draw it, paint it, color it, and just describe it to Miss Evie and Mr. Hyrule, okay? And describe what you're painting. Describe what part of the tree you're painting or what part of the tree you're making. Have fun. See you later, friends.